Hello everyone and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I'm going to be going over the top 5 best paid plugins that you can install on your Minecraft server. Now all of these are going to be updated to 1.13.2 which is the most recent version of Minecraft. However, most of them also work for earlier versions of Minecraft. But nevertheless, before we get into the video, be sure to check out our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. If you go to the first link down below, the breakdown.xyz slash Apex Network, you'll be able to get an awesome Minecraft server for just a few bucks a month, less than a cup of coffee, and you can have the best Minecraft server around. We love them so much, we host our own network Minecraft server, play.breakdowncraft.com on Apex, so come play with us at play.breakdowncraft.com and host your server on the breakdown.xyz slash Apex Network. Nevertheless, guys, let's go ahead and jump on into this. The first plugin that we're going to be talking about here is, of course, Essentials X. Essentials is an essential plugin. It is essential for running a Minecraft server, so why wouldn't you add it to your Minecraft server? Paired with Essential Spawn and Essential Chat, it's going to manage everything you need from warps to set home to even kits and your chat, like customizing how your chat looks and all that. Essentials does all of it, and it is an essential plugin. That's why it's called Essentials. And if you run Essentials X, you're going to have a ton of performance optimizations, a ton of upgrades, and a ton of extra features that you don't have with the boring old Essentials, which actually isn't even updated anymore. So if you're looking for a great Minecraft plugin, Essentials is the only way to go, and you can check it out linked in the description down below, as well as all the other plugins. And I've even got an article linked down below that'll give you five more spigot and bucket plugins plugins that you can install and you'll probably enjoy. But nevertheless, moving on from there, let's talk about World Edit. Now, I'm not just talking about your normal plain old World Edit, I'm talking about Fast Async World Edit. F-A-W-E, also known as FAWE, or Fast Async World Edit, is a much improved version of your standard World Edit. The thing about World Edit and the just default World Edit is it lags servers like crazy. For example, on our server, if you just have normal World Edit and we do anything, like over 20,000 blocks, it just lags the entire server, it's kicking players, it's causing a big mess. But if we use Fast Async World Edit, we can edit hundreds upon hundreds of thousands of blocks at a time without any issues whatsoever. It is incredible. And because of that, I can't recommend Fast Async World Edit enough. If you're running a public server, even if you're running a server with your friends, use Fast Async World Edit. It's going to be a lot easier on your server, a lot less laggy, and just overall better. From there, let's talk about one of my favorite premium plugins ever, and that is Shop GUI Plus. Shop GUI Plus is an incredible plugin that allows you to create an amazing GUI shop where when you type in game slash shop, it comes up and actually shows you the items and actually shows you what you're buying, allows you to buy more, allows you to buy less, all of that stuff. Shop GUI Plus has completely replaced Essentials Sign Shops, so yeah, that is very, very important and something that you really need if you're going to host any sort of Minecraft server. You need a good shop and Shop GUI Plus gives that to you. It is absolutely incredible. We use them ourselves on both our survival and our skyblock server and we we absolutely love them. From there, let's go ahead and talk about banning. So, whenever you're moderating your server and you have rules, you're going to get people on there that are a bit naughty. They might grieve, they might curse, they might disrespect other players, whatever it is, and you're going to need to ban them. Now, if you're on a network server, right, it can be kind of difficult because if you ban them on your survival server, they're not going to be banned on your lobby. They're just going to be banned in survival and they could join into your lobby and still run around and cause havoc there. So you need a plugin that synchronizes bans across all of your servers. And that's where light bans come in. This is another premium plugin, but it is well worth it. Every huge network out server out there, from Skycade to our own network server, they run light bans because it allows you to do so, so much. It bans them across all servers. It allows you to set up a web portal, like a web GUI thing, where everyone can go on a website and see all of the bans that happen on your server, see usernames, see everything. It is an incredible plugin, and there is no other ban management plugin like light bans. That's why it's worth the money, and it is just overall great. Now, on to number five on our list, and the last one on our list here, MCMMO. Now, it was very close between this and Greek Prevention. Greek Prevention is on our top 10 list, which you can check out in the description down below. But MCMMO is another paid plugin, but it's incredible. And if you notice, these plugins are paid because they're good. Good plugins take a lot of work 
and thus good plugins require you to buy them. It's as simple as that. But MCMMO, uh, it's a completely new element to the game and kind of rewards players for doing things like mining and digging up dirt and even falling and uh, you know all that stuff and it gives players something to work for, right? There are players on whose, our server who just love leveling up their MCMMO skills and like grind to level up their MCMMO skills as much as they can and as high as they can in order to max everything out. That's their goal, maxing everything out and MCMMO. That keeps players on your server. That is just something fun to do. I even love checking my MCMMO skills to see where they're at because they give you additional perks and it's just a great overall plugin that ups user engagement and just makes things fun. So that is my top five list of plugins. I have five more linked in the description down below on the breakdown.xyz slash bucket plugins. But if you have any questions, any other plugin ideas, and I miss a plugin here, let me know in the comment section down below of this video and it might just be added to the article on the website. I mean, it's 10 right now. Do we up it to 15 later? Your suggestions might make that happen. But nevertheless, guys, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. My name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown, and I am out. Peace.